I got a bit of a rant video going. I must go to our local city to renew my business license because their online services are, I guess, I don't know, they're, they're not ready to be paid online. Like renewing your business license, that's what I got to do. But you can pull everything up online, you know, with using your license number and all that crap. And um, But it doesn't have your account number, so you have to call and get the account number. Okay, get the account number, then I try to go again, pay it online after calculating my fees and how much I made and all that for the year. Yep, fire truck's out. And uh, calculate all that. Tells me how much I have to pay. Approximately, you know, just under 60 bucks for the year. So, you know, not too bad. So again, I try to go pay it online. No, no. There's no way to do it. It shows zero calculated. So, um, <laughs> yeah. It's calculated to zero. You can't change that. The only way to get it changed is to fax or email the invoice and they don't know their turnaround time right now but if you want it done quick which here it is march and you're supposed to get your business license you know you have four months basically to get it done but you know if you don't then you get fined and all that stuff well here it is march we're already into the third month and i just want to get the thing paid done printed out and you know, on display like it needs to be, so I have no issues, you know, operating without a business license, which is a huge fine if, you know, you get caught. So, no, no, have to go downtown to pay this thing and get them to print the invoice out because their online services are not capable of, you know, doing this, you know, calculating the, the amount and invoicing and all that stuff. It's not all tied together. They don't know if it's going to be tied together. But everything else you can pay online, you know, utilities, you know, phone bill, power bill. I mean, why not a business license? So, anyway, luckily I live pretty close to downtown because <laughs> I'm basically here during this rant. Yeah, let's follow the old police cruiser because it's right next to the police station. I don't know where that one's going. So, yep, here I be. So after I find a parking spot, after I pay my bill, and wow, look at this crap. Friggin' line. Man. Oh man, this place is packed. Holy crap. Not the time to come here, which is currently lunch hour. <laughs> wow. So, I guess we will find a spot somewhere. So I'll park here in the back. Wait for this truck to get out. Alright, I'll continue my rant after I go in, because I know I'm going to have to fight with them on their stupid computer. Alright, as I leave the parking lot. <sighs> Try to get out of here. Alright. Yep. Pretty quick and painless. But again, the apathetic employees, they just no problem taking your money and you know, can't answer questions about when's this going to be fully able to be paid online and stuff like that. So, yep. Typical, typical, you know, workers, I guess. Uh, big UPS freight truck is out. Yeah, the rain's returning. All right, try and get around all this traffic. Rain is increasing, that's for sure. Tell you what, I might take a little detour. They're starting on this project. This is another city uh, city project 
our tax dollars being put to work, so to speak. If I'm not mistaken, yeah, this road is not far from being closed. Okay. So what we go, got going on over here, this used to be a parking lot. Now it is going to become some sort of fancy fountain. There's another building going up over there that used to be a funeral home and the city took that. And uh, yep, so they're doing a lot of uh, reorganizing and redeveloping here in the downtown. I think this will probably take a year or two to get completed, but from what I've seen, yeah, this is eventually, there's more projects down the road that are eventually going to connect to the university nearby, connecting downtown to the local university and all that, so I guess, you know, I guess that's our tax dollars being put to good use, so now I'll just kind of detour back around here. Yeah, this says for customers only, but you know, I doubt I'm gonna be able to get down through there. So, I'll take another detour. Yeah, this is gonna be a mess the rest of this year, probably with all this construction going on. Wouldn't surprise me if some of these houses eventually, this is a historic district, but some of these houses may be targeted for removal in time. Not far from my house either, but. I think I'm in an area that I don't have to worry about that for quite some time. Okay, let's roll. Yep, road's closed. Alrighty then. Get around that goofy car. I don't know what the hell they're doing. And, uh, yeah, so there you go. There's my rant about the city. I guess that's pretty much typical anywhere you live. You know, convenience is not much of an option. But no matter what, you still have to pay your bill. So, <laughs> I don't know. Well, alrighty then. So there's another driving around town video and uh, me rambling so hope you enjoyed it so until the next time adios